Salut la Team Chéro, j'espère que vous allez bien. On se retrouve aujourd'hui pour découvrir Persona 3 Reload qui est disponible à partir du 2 février 2024. J'ai démarré la série Persona avec l'édition royale de Persona 5. Cette version apporte tout de même la traduction en français parce que c'est vrai que les jeux Persona jusqu'à présent n'étaient pas traduits en français et du coup ça apporte un nouveau public et ça c'est plutôt cool pour la licence et du coup la version Persona 3 est également traduit en français et ça c'est cool parce que du coup j'avais pas pu les faire parce que je suis pas non plus un expert en anglais et franchement c'est tip top et on est parti pour découvrir ce Persona 3 Reload, difficulté normale, on est parti. Le temps n'attend personne. Tous, ils nous emportent vers notre fin. Toi, qui viens protéger la lueur de cet avenir limité, tu as un an, pas plus. Va et vis dans le passé qui t'est octroyé, même en ces jours de paix bienheureux, Reste fidèle à la voix de ton cœur. Nous venons d'arriver à la gare d'Iwatodai. Je remets la caméra. Bon, déjà on arrive, <rire> il y a des flasques de sang, ok. Il y a déjà un cercueil, ok. Objet ressemblant à un cercueil, certes. Ce n'est pas un cercueil. Okay. Qu'est-ce que c'est donc Ok. Se rendre au dortoir.
Welcome. You're late. I've been waiting a long time. If you wish to proceed, sign your name here. It's a contract. There's no need to be scared. All it says is that you accept full responsibility for your actions. Je confirme. Good. Time is something no one can escape. It delivers us all to the same end. You can't plug your ears or cover your eyes. And so, it begins. I didn't think you'd arrive so late. My name is Mitsuru Kirijo. I'm one of the students who live in this dorm. Who's he? He's a transfer student. It was a last minute decision to assign him here. He'll eventually be moved to a room in the boys dorm. Is it okay for him to be here? I guess we'll see. This is Yukari Takeba. She'll be a second year this spring, just like you. Call me Takeba. Enchanté. Uh, yeah. Nice to meet you too. It's getting late. You'll find your room at the end of the hall on the second floor. Your things should already be there. Why don't you get some rest? Oh, I'll show you the way. Follow me. Pretty easy to remember, huh? Since it's all the way at the end here. Um, do you have any questions? Huh? Contract? What are you talking about? Uh, can I ask you something? On your way here from the station, was everything okay? Non, pas du tout. Il y avait des espèces de cercueils. <laughs> Je trouve qu'ils ont bien bossé sur le level design. Um, I'm sure you still have questions, but let's save them for later. Okay? Good night. Ma vie au dortoir commence aujourd'hui. La chambre est déjà meublée et a tout le nécessaire. Je n'en peux plus, je devrais ranger mes affaires dans le placard et aller me coucher. Ok. Donc maintenant on peut se déplacer. On a le frigo. Alors, qu'est-ce qu'on doit faire Ah oui, on doit ranger nos affaires dans le placard. Vous pouvez récupérer les DLC achetés depuis le placard de votre chambre. Ok. C'est bon, il a rangé ses affaires dans le placard. Petite sieste, dormez dans votre lit pour faire avancer le temps ou passer à la journée suivante. Les cours commencent demain. Je devrais me coucher tôt afin d'être prêt pour le premier jour. Si tu découvres la série Persona, en fait, on passe de jour en jour comme si en fait on allait pendant une année à l'école, comme ça a été dit en fait durant l'intro. On a un an. Did you 
sleep okay? I've been asked to show you the way to school. If you wanna go ahead, Are you ready to go? Great, let's set out. This is how we'll be getting to school every day. It's a monorail. Pretty cool, huh? I honestly love the ride here. It almost feels like we're flying over the ocean. Oh, by the way, our school's at the last stop on this line. It's called Tatsumi Port Island. Have you heard of it? The whole thing's man-made, and our school's smack dab in the middle. Oh, look, there it is now. Morning. Well, here we are. Allow me to welcome you to Gekko Khan High School. I hope you like it. You'll be okay on your own from here, right? Let's see. I guess you should go see your homeroom teacher first. The faculty office is over there on the left. They'll tell you more when you get there. Oh, well, that about does it. Any questions before I go? Do you want class? Me? I don't know. I haven't looked at the classroom assignments yet. Hey, about last night. Don't tell anyone what you saw, okay? See you. De quoi elle parle? Qu'est-ce qui s'est passé hier soir? <laughs> Bah franchement ça ressemble énormément à Persona 5. Élève en détresse. Ok, je suppose que c'est derrière. D'après la caméra, d'après la map, c'est derrière. C'est visiblement la salle des professeurs. Vais-je entrer Oui. Oh, are you the new student Ah. Hmm. You're a second year, correct Wow, you've lived in a lot of different places. Let's see, 10 years ago, your parents... I'm sorry, uh, I've been so busy, I didn't have time to read this beforehand. I'm Ms. Toriyumi. I teach composition. Welcome to our school. Have you seen the classroom assignments? You're in 2F, that's my class. But first, we need to go to the auditorium. The welcoming ceremony will be starting soon. Come on, I'll show you the way. And so, another new school year is upon us. I'd like each of you to remember the proverb. If a job's worth doing, it's worth doing well. When applied to student life, this means... Psst. Hey! You came to school with Takeba-san this morning, right? I saw you two walking together. You must be pretty close, huh? What's the deal between you and her? Oh, and uh, does she have a boyfriend? <laughs> Nobody seems to know. Je n'en sais rien. Je la connais pas. <laughs> oh really? I thought you might know, but guess not. Wait, how close are you guys? Who's that? Someone's talking. Yeah, sounds like it's coming from Miss Toriyumi's class. Hey, shh. Be quiet. You're gonna get me in trouble. Second year in middle school. 
pretty tough being the new kid at first, you know? So I just wanted to say, hey, see what a nice guy I am? <sighs> hey, hey, it's Yucatan. Didn't think we'd be in the same class again. <laughs> there you go again, acting like everybody's best friend. Try not to make him uncomfortable, okay? What? I was just being friendly. If you say so. Anyway, who'd have thought we'd be in the same homeroom? C'est le destin. Je n'ai pas assez en courage pour dire ça. Je pourrais peut-être sortir ce genre de réplique si j'étais au moins ferme. Du coup, j'ai pas assez de courage, je peux pas dire que c'est le destin, alors je vais dire simplement. <rire> ouais, je sais. Alors, du coup, il va falloir qu'on progresse en courage pour euh, dire certaines répliques. Rien du tout. Okay, good. Seriously, don't say anything about last night, okay? What? Last night? Wait a minute, don't get the wrong idea. Listen, I just met him yesterday, and there is absolutely nothing between us. Jeez, I have to go now. There's something I need to take care of for the archery team. You better not start any more rumors. Ah, who cares? No one takes rumors seriously anyway. She's so paranoid. But hey, it's your first day here, and people are already talking about you. Believe it or not, she's actually pretty popular. Get a man. Well, here's to a fun school year, dude. Ok. On s'est fait un nouveau pote. Je sais pas comment il s'appelle. Jupen yeah. Laurie. Arrête de te plaindre. <rire> Alors qu'est-ce qu'il dit lui C'est toi le nouveau Un club Oui. Un club de quoi Je ne sais pas. Peut-être un club de tennis. Un club de football. Ok, on pourra rejoindre l'entrée principale. Dis donc nouveau. T'as de la veine, t'as pas l'idée. Alors lui, c'est un super dragueur. Retourner au dortoir. Ok. Il y a un truc qui est très important dans... Persona 3, alors je sais pas si ça sera exactement le même principe pour les trophées, alors si t'es chasseur de trophées, alors dans Persona 5 il fallait absolument rien rater parce que sinon t'étais obligé de recommencer une partie pour euh, terminer la chasse au trophée, puisque en fait il y avait beaucoup de trophées qui étaient manquables, j'ai pas du tout regardé la liste des trophées, euh, là j'ai un point d'exclamation ici, ok c'est l'entrée. Oui. Right. 
check out the jocks on their run. Say, you thinking about joining a club? Oh, wait. New members gotta wait a while before they can apply. Your stop's in Iwatodai, right? Forms, man. Must be nice. Talk about living life wild and free. Well, I'm going this way, so see you tomorrow. Ok, donc là, maintenant, il faut retourner au dortoir. On va déjà parler de la petite fille qui est ici. Ok. Il m'a l'air fatigué, lui. Il est au bout de sa vie, regarde. Alors, c'est vrai qu'on a beaucoup de choses à faire, par exemple, un peu plus tard dans l'histoire, on pourra certainement acheter des burgers. Je sais pas si aujourd'hui, on a assez d'argent pour en acheter. Le burger mystère a l'air de bien marcher. Je devrais peut-être l'essayer. Là, tu vois, on peut pas. Euh, à côté, qu'est-ce qu'on a C'est une bibliothèque. Sushi de qualité, je les prépare ici même. Ok, passe nous voir si t'as le temps. Oh, en fait, notre boutique est encore en rénovation. Ok. <rire> Une dinguerie. C'est libéré ici par un restaurant de sushi. Je suis désolé, il est toujours comme ça. Putain, c'est un blagueur. Lui aussi, tu vois, il est au bout de sa vie. Qu'est-ce qu'il a Il y a tellement de boutiques intéressantes par ici que je viens toujours faire un saut. Oh, euh, mais je suis là pour le travail, pas pour ne rien faire. Travail, Sharon. Et là, qu'est-ce qu'il y a Salut, petit. Je t'ai jamais vu dans le coin. C'est normal, je suis nouveau. Nos tacos yaki sont à tomber à la renverse. Tu vas en reprendre garantie sur facture. Okay. Mais de toute façon, pour l'instant, j'ai pas d'argent vu que c'est le premier jour. Allez ailleurs. Le plan de la ville, le plan de la ville vous permet de vous repérer et de vous rendre d'un endroit à un autre. Ok. Rendez-vous à autant d'endroits que possible pour les ajouter au plan. Ok. Et là, on doit aller au dortoir. Donc là, on est. Ok, on est ici. On a le petit icône qui nous l'indique. Et nous, on doit aller au dortoir. Le lycée est ici. On a traversé. Ok. Go le dortoir. On va parler à la petite fille, il y a toutes sortes de boutiques dans, les, dans la rue commerçante d'Iwa Today. Okay. Si tu veux quelque chose de bon, tu peux aller chez Wakatsu ou alors chez Akagure, un restaurant de ramen qui a la côte. Il y a aussi des desserts, des hamburgers et puis... Pardon, je ne parle pas que de nourriture. Ah bon <rire> Ça doit être l'heure de manger, non je plaisante. Ah, t'as peut-être faim Ouais, en fait, l'objectif dans Persona, c'est quand même, pour chaque jour qui passe, de faire un maximum d'actions. Parce que les jours sont comptés, puisque en fait, t'as que une année. Alors, je sais pas dans Persona 3, qu'est-ce qu'il y a, mais euh, dans Persona 5, t'avais une année plus, dans l'édition Royale, t'avais un semestre supplémentaire qui ajoutait également euh, un nouveau personnage. Oui. Pas mal du tout. C'est la rencontre de plein de copains. Allez, ma chambre est là. On va faire un petit somme.
I'm going out for a bit. Hmm? Have you seen the newspapers lately? There's a lot going on. I know. Severe cases of apathy syndrome are suddenly developing in people who showed no symptoms prior. It's been quite a topic of discussion. They say it's due to stress, but... Yeah, right. It's gotta be them. Otherwise, it's not worth my time. You have a one-track mind. Will you be okay out there on your own? Don't worry. I'm just getting a little practice. This isn't a game, Akihiko. still sleeping the dark hour occurs every day at 12 midnight you could say it's the hidden hour during this time an ordinary person transmogrifies into a coffin and is oblivious to all that occurs then he must be as you can see he's retained his human form he may be asleep but he's definitely experiencing the dark hour the only question that remains is whether or not he has the potential. Though, come to think of it, he must. If he didn't, they would have preyed on him by now. Scary. In any case, we should continue to monitor him for a few more days. Yes, sir. I feel kind of bad, though, spying on him like this. On se sent pas du tout surveillé. Ah, la chambre de velours. Allons-nous retrouver Igor Oui, il est là Welcome to the Velvet Room. My name is Igor. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This is Elizabeth. She's a resident here, like myself. Pleased to meet you. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. Only those who have signed the contract can enter this place. From now on, you shall be welcome here. You were destined to hone your unique ability. I only ask you one thing. Abide by your contract. And a Très bien. Hold on to this. Clé de velours. Until we meet a... Is he? Looks like he's a little worn out. He went to bed without changing out of his uniform. Other than that, nothing has changed since last night. 
Hmm. Very interesting. Even those who have the potential tend to be unstable at first. Memory loss, disorientation. This subject is rather unique. He hasn't exhibited any of the common symptoms. But we're treating him like a guinea pig. Oh, don't look at it like that. The two of you are classmates, right? Consider it an opportunity to have someone your own age here. Besides, we need all the help we can get. I guess that's true, but still... Command room speaking. Akihiko, what's wrong? <clears throat> You're not gonna believe it. This thing is huge. Unfortunately, it's chasing after me right now. I'm almost back. Just letting you know in advance. Does that mean he's bringing that thing here? Mr. Chairman, that's enough observation for now. We need to prepare for combat. Uh, right. Be careful. Akihiko! <sighs> I'm all right. Get ready to be surprised. It'll be here any second. This is no time to joke around. Is it one of them, Sanada-kun? Yeah, but not an ordinary one. Ah! What was that? You've got to be kidding me! Mr. Chairman, please head for the command room. Takeba, go upstairs and wake him up. Then escape out the back. But what about you two? We'll stop it here. You're the one who led it to us, Akihiko. So I'm going to have you fight. It's not like I asked it to follow me. What are you waiting for, Takeba? Go! Uh, okay. Qu'est-ce qui se passe Eh ben, nous filer un fringue. Une épée courte. Ah, ça y est, je voulais en arriver ici, en fait. Puisque c'est vrai, depuis le début, en fait, on n'a pas de combat. Et je voulais te montrer le système de combat qui est énormissime vers le milieu de partie endgame. Puisque, en fait, il y a tellement de possibilités. Qu'est-ce que c'est On ouvre <rire> Moi je veux me battre Alors, vous mettre à l'abri, mais où À l'étage De toute façon, on n'a pas d'autres possibilités. Pas du tout. <rire> Dinguerie. On va se battre. Monsters that 
It's here. <laughs> Wait. Earth was that? Je dois la protéger. Donc là, en fait, il vient de débloquer sa persona. Et du coup, on va pouvoir jouer avec maintenant des personnes. Ok, donc maintenant, tu vois, on peut utiliser en fait sa persona. On peut utiliser un sort de feu. Donc ils sont faibles au feu. On peut se mettre en garde, donc du coup ça va nous permettre de nous protéger durant le prochain tour. Donc là non c'est pas l'objectif, là ça va être attaqué avec l'épée. esprit s'éclaircit. Je sens une présence à mes côtés. Où suis-je Really 
You mean the shadows? They're what we're fighting against. And that power you used, we call it Persona. Don't worry, we'll explain everything later. I'm sorry I didn't tell you before. I, uh... I wanted to tell you something. I can kind of relate. To you, I mean. My dad died in an accident when I was little, and my mom and I aren't exactly on good terms. You're all alone too, aren't you? To be honest, I already heard about your past, but it didn't seem fair, so I wanted you to know about mine too. This was a while ago, but there was a big explosion in the area. Supposedly, my dad died in the blast, but nobody really knows what happened. At the time, he was working in a lab run by the Kirijo group, so I'm hoping if I stick around long enough, I'll find out more about it. That's why I'm going to Gekukan High. And why I was there when this happened to you. Not that I was much help. I kind of panicked. That was my first time facing them too. Sorry. You wouldn't have to go through all this if I weren't such a coward. Thanks. Sorry for telling you all this the minute you opened your eyes. While I was waiting, I thought to myself, I've been hiding so many things from him. As soon as he wakes up, I'll tell him the truth. So thanks for listening. I've been wanting to share that story with someone for a long time. All right, I'm gonna get going. I'll let the others know you're okay. They said you could leave once you regain consciousness. So I think you're free to go home. See you. Pendant les heures de classe, parfois les professeurs vont te poser des questions, alors ça arrive de temps en temps. Et il va falloir bien y répondre, pourquoi Parce qu'en fait ça va donner des points à savoir et du coup ta note va augmenter. Et là par exemple il y a une question, comment appelle-t-on les endroits où étaient jetés les déchets alimentaires à l'air Chaumont Des cimetières je pense pas, des cambuses je pense pas non plus, j'irai plutôt des amas de coquilliers. On va tester... C'est bon. Il a bien répondu. On a bien répondu, ça c'est cool. Et là du coup, on gagne un point supplémentaire en savoir. Ah, en charme Ok. Bon, bah tant mieux. Donc en fait, on a trois types de points. Donc là, on y... Quelconque en charme, en savoir, on est tir au flanc, et là, on a un point en courage, on est timide. Ah, there you are. Looks like you've recovered. I'm glad to see that. There are some things I need to discuss with you. That's why I asked you to see me so soon after your discharge from the hospital. Uh, please, have a seat. Oh, before that. I believe I mentioned his name before, but this is Sanada-kun. Hey there. Okay, let me start off by asking you this. Would you believe me if I said that a day consists of more than 24 hours? <laughs> That's a reasonable reaction. However, you've already experienced this truth firsthand. Do you remember the night you first arrived here? You had to have noticed the signs. Street lights going out, things that stopped working, the inexplicable appearance of coffins. With so many things amiss, didn't it feel like you'd stepped into a different time? That's the dark hour. A time period hidden between one day and the next. I guess it's more like something people simply aren't cognizant of. But the dark hour does exist and it occurs each night at midnight. It will happen tonight and every night to come. Normal people don't realize it since they're all sleeping inside their coffins. But that's not what makes the dark hour so interesting. You saw them, those creatures. We call them shadows. They only appear during the dark hour and attack anyone who roams free outside the coffins. It's our job to defeat them. Pretty exciting, huh? Akihiko, why are you always like this? You just got hurt the other day. Now, now, he does his work well in any case. 
I'll get to the point. We are the Specialized Extracurricular Execution Squad. C's for short. On paper, we're classified as a school club. But in reality, this group is dedicated to defeating the shadows. Mitsuru Kirijokun is the leader, and I'm the club advisor. A shadow feeds on the mind of its prey. The victim becomes a living corpse. Apathy syndrome. I'm sure you've heard of it. We sometimes refer to those who suffer from this as the lost. They're responsible for most of the incidents on the news, if not all of them. Although rare, there are those who can function during the dark hour. Some may even awaken to a power that enables them to fight shadows. That's known as Persona. The power you called upon the other night. Shadows can only be defeated by Persona users. That means you are the only ones who stand a chance against them. I'm glad you're quick to understand. What he's trying to say is, we want you to join us. We've prepared an evoker for you. We'd like you to lend us your strength. <laughs> I was afraid you'd say no. Thank you so much. Truly. Oh, I almost forgot. About your room assignment. Why don't you just stay in the room you have now? I don't know what the holdup is, but I guess it worked out in the end. <laughs> Hold up? But wasn't that... Oh, never mind. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the fool arcana. Well, that's all for today. I'll follow up with you regarding our club activities later on. I apologize for gathering you all here on your precious day off. Tomorrow is Sunday, so take some time to relax. Well then, shall we end this meeting? You know, because it's the weekend, shall we end? Shall week end get it hi how have you been <laughs> we've met before soon the end will come i remembered so I thought I should tell you. It's the end of everything, but to be honest, I don't really know much about it. More importantly, it looks like you've awakened to your power, and what an unusual power it is. A power that takes many forms, yet is bound by none. It might even prove to be your salvation, depending on where you end up. Do you remember when we first met? I expect you to honor your commitment. I'm always watching you, even if you forget about me. Okay then, see you later. You are, could you come downstairs? All right, everyone's here. Heck yeah, let's get right into it. Now, 
I'd like your undivided attention. For a long time, Kirijo-kun and Sanada-kun were the only Persona users we had. But that number has recently jumped to five. So here's the plan. Starting tonight at 12 a.m., I'd like us to finally begin exploring Tartarus. Uh, so, I asked this yesterday, but what is that Tartar thing again? It's Tartarus. You seriously haven't seen it, Junpei? Uh, I mean... It's no surprise you haven't seen it. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour, after all. Only during the dark hour? Just like the shadows. Interesting, huh? The goal of our club, Seas, is to fight those shadows. However, simply defeating shadows during the dark hour isn't enough. We must get to the root of the problem. We need to destroy the dark hour itself. Uh, I don't really get it. You're saying if we run around Tartarus, we can somehow get rid of the dark hour? We don't know for certain. Sorry I can't give you a better answer. But investigating the mysteries of that tower is part of our job. The bottom line is, we need more information. Everything we encounter there will be a vital clue for us. The exploration of Tartarus is of utmost importance. Consider it our top priority. Our society, while remaining blissfully unaware of the shadows, is slowly but surely succumbing to their influence. I would go as far as to say that the fate of the world rests on the shoulders of you Persona users. That's one hell of a responsibility. But the heroes of justice will prevail! It's also the perfect spot for us to train and improve our skills. That place is like a nest of shadows, you know. Whoa, they're nest, huh? But Senpai, what about your injury? Akihiko's still recovering from his wounds. He'll accompany us, but won't participate in the exploration. <sighs> yeah, I know. Relax! Oh, Junpei's got your backs. I'm not so sure about this. What about you, Mr. Chairman? I'll stay here. Not much point, anyway, since I can't summon a persona. Huh? We're here? Uh, what's going on? Why are we at school? Just wait and see. It's almost midnight. This is Tartarus, the labyrinth that reveals itself during the dark hour. Labyrinth? What are you talking about? What happened to our school? Once the dark hour passes, everything will return to normal. This is the nest you were talking about? But why? Why'd our school turn into a giant tower? <sighs> you don't know either? No. I'm sure it's complicated. If we don't know, we'll just have to find out. Mitsuru and I have only gone in to take a peek. This will be our first time exploring it. Exciting, huh? There's gotta be something in there. Hopefully some sort of clue about the dark hour. Akihiko, I respect your enthusiasm, but you won't be exploring it today. I know. You don't have to keep reminding me. Oh. 
it's just as crazy on the inside. Sure is creepy, though. This is only the entrance. The labyrinth lies beyond the doorway at the top of these stairs. First, you need to get a feel for the place. Why don't the three of you go have a look around? What? By ourselves? We're not asking you to go very far. I'll help you navigate by feeding you information from here. We'll also need to appoint a leader to make any necessary decisions. A leader? Like... the captain of a pirate ship? I'm in! Me! 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 Pick me! <sighs> You're in charge. Wait! Why him? He doesn't look like a captain! Calm down. He has experience fighting already. Wait, seriously? That's true too, but the main reason is far more simple. Junpei, and you too, Takeba. Can either of you summon your persona without difficulty like he can? Yeah, of course I can. Me too. These are shadows we're talking about. Without your persona, you're screwed. I'm aware of that. All right, let's head inside. Are you ready, leader? Prêt. <rire> That's the spirit. Allons découvrir le tartare. L'entrée du labyrinthe se trouve en haut des escaliers. Dès que tu te sens prêt à explorer, ouvre la main. Qu'est-ce que c'est Qu'est-ce que c'est Je n'ai jamais rien vu de pareil. En tout cas, ça me semble pas fonctionner pour l'instant. Ok. Donc ça, c'est la chambre de velours. C'est là où on va pouvoir en fait... Euh Échanger, alors je sais pas si on va pouvoir fusionner dans P3, j'ai pas joué à P3, premier du nom, horloge, quelle grande horloge, elle n'a pas l'air de fonctionner, ok, oh il y a une moto, allez let's go, on va découvrir le tartare Ok, let's go En tout cas, c'est classe Donc là on peut utiliser la persona ou bien évidemment attaquer. Donc, on a déjà vu comment ça fonctionne. On utilise la persona. Ha 
my persona ability. Yeah, yeah, that was amazing. Well done, Iori. Considering it was your first battle, you did well. Takeba too. He'll be fine. Don't be afraid to show what you can do. Got it. Good. Let's continue exploring. Alors là, on peut descendre et de ce côté, il y a rien. Ah si. Il <rire> y a rien du tout. OK. Another shadow up ahead. Let's get you more accustomed to combat. The battle's about to begin. Everyone stay focused. All right. Next, let's go over a useful approach for defeating enemies. Most enemies have an elemental affinity that they have low resistance to. Targeting weaknesses is one of the best ways to deal damage. Not only that, it can also knock enemies down. Knocking down an enemy creates an opening, letting you continue your offense. Weaknesses, huh? Done. I'll show you how it's done. Wait! Let me handle this one. Just point it to my head and pull the trigger. I can do this! Je m'arrête quelques instants juste pour te présenter le système de combat de Persona. En tout cas, c'était comme ça dans le Persona 5, mais je pense qu'ils ont fait exactement le même système de combat d'après ce que je vois. En fait, dans Persona 5, il fallait connaître toutes les faiblesses de chaque ennemi. En fait, à partir du moment où tu connais toutes les faiblesses, donc les faiblesses élémentaires, et bien en fait, tu fais des one more à chaque fois. Et là, ça va être pareil, puisque en fait, elle a utilisé sa compétence, elle a fait faiblesse, et du coup, elle a pu utiliser son attaque à l'arc avec un one more. Chaque compétence et attaque possède une affinité. Les ennemis auront des points faibles envers certaines affinités. Attaquer sur le point faible de l'ennemi infligera plus de dégâts que d'habitude, l'ennemi sera également mis à terre. Lorsqu'un ennemi est mis à terre, vous pouvez utiliser One More. Donc là, tout à l'heure, on a vu qu'il était sensible au feu. Bon, là, on ne sait pas à quoi il est sensible, mais nous, on le sait. Bon, là, idéalement, c'est de réutiliser la Persona, parce qu'on sait que cet ennemi est faible au feu. Je trouve que le tartare il ressemble beaucoup au memento. Non Qu'est-ce que t'en dis Alors ici il n'y a rien. Je sais pas s'il y a des coffres. Je regarde. En plus d'après ce qu'il disait, c'était que ça se générait de manière aléatoire. Donc c'est un petit peu le même principe. Ouais, c'est un coffre, non Yes, boxes like those seem to be scattered all throughout Tartarus. Sometimes they contain useful items for battle. Seek them out as often as you can. Oh, sweet. So they're basically like treasure chests. Hell yeah. That looks like it'll be useful. It's up to you to decide how to use it.
Ok, il y a un autre coffre ici. Alors... Là, il y a un ennemi, on va se le faire. Raté. <rire> C'est la bonne. Next, I'm going to explain a tactic for defeating several enemies at once. First, go ahead and strike an enemy's weakness. I'll keep track of tactical data such as any enemy weaknesses you've identified. If you ever forget an enemy's affinities, just let me know and I'll get that data for you. Là, ah, sympa. On peut analyser. Peut-être que c'était déjà le cas en fait dans Persona 5. Donc lui on sait qu'il est sensible hein, au feu. Donc, il se feu. Ah oui, à l'assaut général, c'est vrai. L'assaut général. Comment on fait du coup j'ai pas vu. Ah voilà. <rire> Excellent. Obtenez Assara, personnage de la carne de la paresse. Okay. Alors on continue d'explorer, là il y a un ennemi. I detect another shadow up ahead. Take advantage of what you just learned. Try not to alert the enemy as you move. On va tenter. Ah je sais pas si j'ai réussi à l'avoir. On a l'avantage, c'est bon. Donc là je peux lancer glace, je sais pas s'ils sont sensibles. Bon de toute façon l'objectif hein, c'est d'utiliser euh, la personne qu'on vient de récupérer, c'est de lancer glace. Donc elle est sensible à la glace, c'est bon. Donc là pour faire l'assaut général, en fait maintenant ce qu'il faut faire... Attends, je vais enlever la caméra parce que sinon tu vois pas l'ennemi. Euh, c'est qu'il faut utiliser la Persona, donc soit on utilise... Absara, mais de toute façon, je peux pas changer de Persona, donc on va l'utiliser. Et là, maintenant, on peut faire assaut général. Les musiques sont top, hein. Franchement, euh, je me régale. Les deniers, carte de compétences. L'expérience acquise lors de ce combat augmentera. Vous restaurez 50% de vos PV max. Oh, 
The enemy has been defeated. Excellent work. Um, was that...? Well, it looks like he has the ability to summon different personas. I suspected as much after the events from the other day, but now we know for sure. Ok, téléporteur. Ah, C'est le niveau 2. Ok, donc là en fait, si on continue, on va au niveau 2 mais c'est pas du tout ce qu'il nous demande il nous demande d'utiliser le téléporteur Look, that treasure chest looks different from the one before Yes, that particular box is sealed in a special way The box can be unlocked by its own mechanism but it needs something else to work during the dark hour What's that you got there? I wonder. Coffre verrouillé, donc on peut le débloquer avec des fragments de crépuscule. Tu peux en trouver dans Tartare ou à d'autres endroits où. On détecte des ombres. Ok. Si tu en trouves sur ton chemin, n'hésite pas à les prendre. Mais ça me dit pas où est le téléporteur. Ah bah il est là. Welcome back. So, how was it? C'était épuisant. It must have hit you all at once. Don't worry. You'll get used to it. Wow. I never knew I had that kind of power. But damn. Why do I feel so exhausted? Cuz you were bouncing around like a little kid. You say that, but You look pretty tired yourself, Yukatan. This is different. It's like I'm having trouble breathing. What's going on? That's the effect of the dark hour. You'll become fatigued more easily. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. I have to say though, I'm surprised. You all did much better than I expected. At this rate, they'll catch up to you in no time, Akihiko. <laughs> we'll see about that. On obtient une nouvelle carte, non Ah non, rang 2 le mat, ok. On passe rang 2. Eh ben écoute, bonne sensation Je m'attendais pas du tout que ça soit aussi bien que Persona 5. J'aurais peut-être un petit bémol. Parce que, en fait, dans les profondeurs de Memento dans Persona 5, tu as tout le temps les mêmes biomes un petit peu... Ça se ressemble beaucoup quand même. J'espère qu'il y aura d'autres biomes parce que si on a tous les étages avec le même biome, la même ambiance, ça risque d'être assez répétitif. J'espère qu'on aura d'autres biomes parce que c'est vrai dans Persona 5 on a plein de donjons. Les biomes sont complètement différents, on a pas mal de choses, on a un mois ou deux généralement dans, des, dans les donjons. Donc ça c'est plutôt cool. A voir. Ah il fait du baseball. Ok. A voir. Bah franchement ça sera mon prochain jeu puisque... 
D'abord, je vais démarrer Grand Blue Rolling, qui est un très bon JRPG, j'accroche, franchement. D'ailleurs, si tu veux jouer avec moi, je mettrai mon ID PSN dans la description, et on pourra jouer, bien évidemment, ensemble. Après, je jouerai AP3 Reload, puisque c'est une... C'est un très bon reboot. Franchement, ça va être pas mal, je le sens. Allez, on se dit à bientôt. Ciao, ciao